Today is the last day of Black History Month, so to get her thoughts, we turn to an actual black expert, Dulce Sloan. <laughs> Hello, friends. Today is February 29th, which is Leap Day and Black Women's History Day! <laughs> and if you don't know that, it's because I just made it up. <laughs> Why? Because the rest of February is taken. Dr. King gets two weeks, the presidents get a three-day weekend, and they even give a day to a groundhog. <laughs> what the hell is a groundhog? That's not even, like, is that even a real animal? <laughs> Are we sure? Is it just a big-ass guinea pig with a good publicist? <laughs> so I'm claiming February, so I'm claiming February 29th for us. Yay! <laughs> Why only one day every four years? Because you account for, you know, the wage gap and your mom and them. You know, the math works out, okay? <laughs> Trust me, I carried the four and everything. <laughs> but the day is almost over, so let's celebrate some black women as fast as we can. Okay, throw a clock on the screen. Wait, no, that, that looks like a shot clock. This ain't the NBA. No, no, no. <laughs> Make it historical. <laughs> it, is that a cuckoo clock? <laughs> are you trying to say black women are crazy? <laughs> The nerve, the unmitigated girl! <laughs> okay, just put up any clock. Oh, hey, sis. Okay, I like her. She's black, and she looks like she don't take no shit from nobody. <laughs> okay, let's celebrate some black women. Start the clock. Okay, Shirley Chisholm, incredible congresswoman, chiseled her way into history by being the first black woman to run for president for a major party in 1972. She spent 14 years in Congress representing Brooklyn. And I mean Brooklyn, Brooklyn. <laughs> Spike Lee, Brooklyn. <laughs> Not Lena Dunham, Brooklyn. <laughs> If you thought Biggie had a tough time making money, imagine going door to door in bed style asking for campaign contributions. <laughs> Donations, raise money. <laughs> Donations, raise money. Y'all was off beat, that's all right. Listen, <laughs> next. Dr. Shirley Jackson. Ooh, another Shirley. The first black woman to earn a doctorate from MIT. She helped innovate touch-tone phones, portable fax machines, and caller ID. She's the only reason long-distance relationships work. <laughs> so every time you use your phone, pour a little Wi-Fi out for your girl, Shirley. <laughs> Next up, Missy Elliott. Proving that black women can make a hit song while singing forwards and backwards. <laughs> it's your finna whipping you in any yet? Is that how you say that? <laughs> Missy, we salute you. You salute we Missy. <laughs> See, that's backwards, okay? <laughs> Look at your girl, all right? Okay, we got an auntie in the White House. Yes, Ms. Kamala Harris. First female VP and one bad bike ride away from being president. <laughs> I, 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 listen, I'm just saying, if Huffy Bikes really wanted a female president, loosen some chains at the factory. <laughs> Y'all could make history. Help a sister out. Come on. <laughs> Next. Mae Jemison. The first black woman in space in 1992. What took so long? <laughs> and that makes sense, because in the 90s, black people were doing whatever they could to get the farthest away from the LAPD. <laughs> so you saying I could go to outer space while these cops stay on Earth? Oh, I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. Come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And the most amazing thing is that she came back. <laughs> That's never a guarantee, but girl, why? <laughs> There's a black woman on Family Matters that went upstairs and never came back down again. <laughs> Next, Lisa Leslie. <laughs> a basket 
basketball legend who was the first woman to dunk in the NBA. That's right, she can dunk, which is way more impressive because when women do it, we do it with titties. <laughs> Slows you down. <laughs> she changed the game, like me, every time I played Uno with my five-year-old nephew. Draw four, draw 17, Uno, ha! In your face, Declan. <laughs> Next! Hey, it's my mommy! Aww. Hey, everybody, look at my mama! <laughs> She's out there every day giving, serving, loving, and I mean literally mothering me. And literally mothering. And, you know, <laughs> she made me. You're welcome! <laughs> I'm surprised I was able to cover that many people. That's okay. You know, we can celebrate even more black women in 2028, so. <laughs> <laughs> There's not gonna be an earth then. <laughs> so, Dual Sloan, everybody. Yeah.